I feel like I've got a little speed to me. Um, so it was fun to finally finally use that one. I think my high school coach, Todd Dodge, is going to be proud of that one. So um, he always says, you see that crease, go split it. So you just kind of saw it. And man, Troy fitted it up great on the second level and it was wide open. And we just we executed really well. And all I had to do was just go hit it and, and take off. So it was fun. It was, it was really fun. Kate, how did it feel to kind of back up the App State game with another kind of statement came against an ACC team? Yeah, it's great. You know, I mean, that's a that's a that's a good opponent that that will always challenge us every single year. Um, so to to play the way we did and to just kind of come out and and uh, not really skip a beat, just you know, especially after a bye week. You know, I mean, just kind of we got we got better over the last two weeks and we we kept that momentum going and and really just started how we left off. So it was great. How big was that that fast start to jump out to that fourteen nothing lead really quickly in the first quarter? It's huge, especially in games like that versus a team like them that's going to, you know, really fight till the end. Um, to just kind of get an early jump on them and, and get some momentum going our way was was great. And um, you know, we, we executed really well. I, I love the game plan that Coach Riley and and that offensive staff um, put together. But you know, we we went and executed really well and um, it was great. It was really fun. And then the defense had two turnovers in the first quarter too. How big was that helping you guys with a short field? Yeah, it's huge. I mean, we got you know we got it. I think like on the forty and then somewhere down there again and. Um, it's great. I mean, that's complimentary football at its finest. You know, defense can go <clears throat> get those turnovers, but if we don't go, you know, kind of take advantage of it, you know, that's not complimentary football. But we, you know, we went and played complimentary, complimentary football today, and that, that was really special. You talk about loving the game plan, the up tempo. It seems like yeah. you, like a, you really excel when yeah. you're up tempo and moving. Is that part of the game plan that you like so much? Yeah, I mean, I love it. I mean, I, you know, I, I always, you know, love playing with a lot of tempo and just kind of keeping the defense on their heels whenever I can. So, um, <clears throat> I think that our coaches do a great job of. I think honestly, that if you're gonna have a great tempo, that starts up front um, because you know those are the guys that aren't always the fastest on the field. But if they they do a great job conditioning themselves all year round to to be able to play like that, and you know, whenever you can go play fast and and Ryan get the ball set and when those guys up front get set and we get the call the call in um, <clears throat> we do a great job in practice of trying to make it as as game like as we can that you know when we get to a, a game it's just it's just like practice that's the intensity that we bring every single day and um, you know we just kind of went and executed okay, yeah, that's, that's time one the, that's one of the okay right here that's one of the defenses the last three years have been in the top two in the ACC in total defense to do that against them today now, what does that do for your guys' confidence as a group? Yeah, that's a you know that's a that's a challenging defense um, that always takes a lot of preparation just because you know they're very very well coached and have great players on that side. So um, and they're they're you know they'll they'll blitz you and co come cover zero any play of the game. I mean they did on the very first play of the game. So um, <clears throat> in terms of our you know our checks and our comms on um, this game, coach did a great job of getting us ready and you know I, I really got dialed in on. Always having an answer. Always having an answer, and, and uh, that's what's great about our offenses. You know, there's freedom, freedoms in it. There's managed freedoms in terms of being able to check. Um, where you know, if we're not in a, in a good play, we at least get into a pretty good play. Um, and you know, that happened a few times tonight. And, um, you know, we just went and executed and did a great job, and just trusted my eyes. Um, and we protected really well. Um, so, I mean, another game without a sack, for sure. So, okay, it's great. They're, they're uh, killing it. So. Uh, we saw you go give that touchdown ball to Adam after yeah. his first touchdown. What did that moment mean to you? Yeah, oh, man, that was so fun. That was that was one of my favorite moments of even being at Clemson. Um, I mean, Adam's been, you know, I mean, you all know, Adam's been one of my best friends since I got here. He's been my roommate my whole time. And um, he's been... He's he's been working his butt off since he got here, and he's he's been eager for that, and I've been so eager for him to have that moment. Um, so kind of you know tag tag that route on the goal line for him, and I knew that you know it's it's him and one on one with any guy down there, he's gonna win. So just just trust it, trust it in the preparation that we've been doing for the last three years, and um, but then you know I, I I made sure I was going to get that ball for him um, because you know I just I needed that ball for him, so it was so special and. Um, just really, really cool moment. This time last year, Antonio was done for the season. How great is it to have that guy back? And the ha first half he had looked like he, he almost had a hat trick there in the first half on that yeah. slant. Yeah, uh, you know he's he's an incredible player, but he's an even better leader. Um, and just the way that he leads, you know, our guys in that room, um, it's so special. Him and Adam are just they're phenomenal leaders. Um, and, and when 
when one guy kind of got to step up, those guys step up, and you know whether it's Brian or Adam this game, and you know guys step up and make plays, and that's what we need in that room. So I'm um, just really proud of him, and you know obviously thankful to have a guy like Antonio in that room. The the explosive way you guys are generating, the explosive plays that you guys are generating right now. I think people are looking at Clemson and saying they haven't had this many explosive plays in a while. What has changed for you guys offensively in these last couple of games? It just feels like every time you guys have the ball, it's a threat to go 50 yards and a touchdown. Yeah, I think that you know, I think there's a little bit of a mentality change. Um, we've got the guys to go do it, and you know, we've got the protection up front to go do it. And it's 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 not just hey, let's just run verts every time. You know, it's 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 managed and and well called and well executed, um, and when we have the opportunities to do it, we're gonna get, we're gonna get after them. So, um, you know, it's just it's just kind of us playing ball at, at times. So that's really what it comes down to. The battle to the end last year, Raleigh uh, to have that strong finish kind of inspired y'all to kind of roll with it to, to a dominating point like today. I mean, just talk about how the offense has kind of come together as the season rolls on and what to expect with Stanford coming in here next uh, Saturday night. Yeah, um, you know, obviously last year, walking off that field versus them, we're sitting four and four. And uh, that was that was a, an hour and a half after that game that I'll never, I'll never forget that feeling. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, we, we, we finished after that, after that loss, we finished the rest of the year great. And, uh, but, you know, I think that this game was definitely a little personal for me, especially and for, for some of these guys who were on that team last year. And, um, just really special win. And, you know, they're, they're a great football team. It's going gonna, it's gonna to bring it, and uh, they're a team you always got to prepare really well for. So really special win. Going to make you feel good last two games here. Kind of brought back memories to the fans of the quick strike, deep strike offenses when they <laughs> were national championships. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's fun. You know, I, I love it, and you know, I love using my legs and being able to get the ball downfield. So, um, I think that we've got every every uh, every tool in the toolbox that we need to go do it, and that's uh, really special. That, that big first run you had right off the top did that really help kind of settle you down for the rest of the time you were in there? Um, I mean, I, I felt really settled down from the first play, to be honest. Um, I know that's not a great answer, but um, I think that. The way that I, I prepare throughout the week and the way that Coach Riley pushes me throughout the week and, and the, the way that we push each other um, and practice every day that I mean I get I mean I'm in warm ups and I'm like, hey, it's just it's just practice. Like, we're running the same place. Um, and we just got a different color jersey on the other side. Just that's the mentality that, that we just kinda have. Um, it's just we, we push ourselves very hard in practice to to be as game like as we can, so whenever it does come up, we're ready and we're ready to go. How neat was it for you to be a part of history today? Eight hundredth win for this program, just wow. the fourteenth school ever to do that. I mean, it's it's amazing. There's just there's so much history and and just um, it's a lot of wins for for a program like this. So just an honor an honor to be able to have that. Um, but you know, that's just that's really kudos to all the teams that came before us. Like you're playing your best ball here right now. The best of games. Um, I mean, I just I feel like I'm playing like me. You know, I just I feel like I'm just I'm calm out there and I'm ready and I'm just seeing it really well. And um, but I just I feel I feel really comfortable out there because I've got so much trust in the guys around me and um, it's 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 not me that's doing anything special out there. It's just the guys around me that are playing so good and um, making my job easier. When you guys look at the big picture now, the ACC. Where do you see yourself right now? I mean, things are kind of shaping up for you guys to be able to make a, a run at this thing. Oh yeah, I mean, obviously, if we want to go to the uh, to the playoffs, it's going to run through the AC championship game, and you know, now we've got the tiebreaker versus NC State, and we're, we're ready for a great team to, to come in here next week versus uh, versus Stanford. So, was your uh, heart in your throat a little bit when Phil went down? It looked like he came down on his shoulder, maybe. He's a tough guy. Yeah, I know he's going to be back in here pretty soon. So, yeah. How about Obviously, you? don't want to lose a guy like that, but he's, he's a tough guy. How about how about the job the offensive line did, you know, in pass protection? And, and obviously, running the ball, you had great balance today. Incredible. I mean, yeah. I think at one point, whenever I came off the field, we were, like, dead even mm -hmm. um, in, in running and passing. So, uh, that's that's great. That's tough on the defense. I think that's challenging them because you can't play – can't play both. You got to kind of pick one at times. So to be able to do that is really special. Um, but man, I'm so freaking proud of him. I mean, it's uh, 
you know, it's great to have Marcus back, and um, yeah, it's just it's fun. Just fr freaking love those dudes. They're the hardest dudes, hardest working dudes on our whole team. And Coach Luke is an incredible coach and, and leads them so well. So.